Hey guys, uh, this is the second installment in my little series I'm making called Working for Kirby Vacuum. So, uh, as you guys can see, I uh, posted a uh, first video a few hours ago. Uh, so this is the second video. So today was my official first day, I guess you can say. I uh, started my orientation. Uh, so in the orientation, you know, they told us, you know, the business model where, you know, we're guaranteed a base pay of 450, 425 a week. But that's contingent, contingent on us demonstrating the product 10 times in a work week. You know, we can demonstrate them 10 times in three days. We can demonstrate them 10 times in the six day work week. They have a six day work week Monday through Saturday. All right. So our price as the the seller is eleven fifty one thousand one hundred fifty dollars and the machine goes for nineteen ninety five one thousand nine hundred ninety five dollars so let's say I make a sale on a machine for seventeen hundred dollars and it gets financed the finance company takes ten percent of that so they would take hundred seventy dollars so then what that's one thousand seven hundred one thousand six hundred one thousand five hundred seventy dollars. Okay, so you know we would start at eleven fifty, twelve fifty, thirteen fifty, fourteen fifteen, fifteen fifty, fifteen fifty, fifteen seventy. I would make a commission of four hundred twenty dollars. Now let's say I make three of those sales in a week out of my ten things. You know, for let's just say four hundred, four hundred, eight hundred, twelve hundred dollars. I'd make twelve hundred dollars a week just in commission. I wouldn't get my base pay though, but they give you a bonus of two hundred dollars if you sell three in a week. So then what? That would make it $1,400. So, you know, I have the potential to make good money. Now, the one thing that they left out in the orientation to all the people that are amazed by this is that we are going to be labeled as independent contractors. I, you know, I researched this shit. Nobody else probably took the time to. We're going to be labeled as independent contractors, which means at the end of the year, you know, when you file your 1099, you're going to get a big slap from the government. Okay, well, you owe us this much money because we didn't take any taxes from you throughout the year, which that's fine. You know, I'll put like 10% of each of my weekly checks aside for the end of the year for my 1099. Uh, they demonstrated the product. They showed us, you know, it has 12 different features. You know, I'm surprised this thing can even unclog a drain. It is a good vacuum. You know, it really is a good vacuum. Would I pay $1,900 for one? Hell no. And I told them that, and they got offended. They started saying, well, you know, you wouldn't want to live with dust mites, right? You know, and I was like, well, you know, I think the life expectancy of somebody who owns one and somebody who doesn't own one is about the same. And they got a little pissy about that, but nothing that I have to uh, worry about. Uh, so it, it's a process like this. It's unpaid training. So tomorrow through Saturday, today is Wednesday. So Thursday, Friday, Saturday, I will be there from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m., 6 hours, 6, 12, 18 hours. That's unpaid for. But I'm unemployed right now, and I'm not making money doing anything else. So, I mean, it is what it is. Uh, yeah, so, you know, I'm going to best 18 hours. I'll be off Sunday. And then Monday I start. You have to wear a button-down and a tie, some slacks or khakis. And they're going to start us off solely at first as doing demonstrations. You know, we might sell one. You never know. You know, you do a good demonstration. Somebody might say they want one. But eventually, you know, they'll put us out on the field to solely try to do the demonstrations and sell. But they're starting us out with a base pay of $4.25 a week to demonstrate 10. Now, I asked a question because he made an example of, you know, let's say you did nine showings in a week and you sold four of them. And, you know, I was, and he was like, you know, and then you do one on Saturday and there goes nine. You mean, you know, you sold four throughout the week. I was like, well, would we have to come in on a Saturday to do our 10th? He was like, if you sell three or more a week, so as soon as you sell those three, I don't care if you take out the rest of the week. And I mean, think about it too. Our bottom price is 1150. Okay. So like I said, you know, I sold one and you know, after the finance company takes theirs and the people barter, you know, there's $1,400 right there. Or fifteen, whatever I said. And then, you know, the 1150 taken off of what I, you know, got the machine for after the finance company took their 10%. Or 
would give me like $420, it said. Well, then, you know, the company, they'd take eleven fifty of that sale, no matter what. So, I mean, you know, you got to think about it. If he has 10 people and they all sell three a week, that's 30 a week. You know, that's $30,000 a week. So, all in all, I guess I can say it isn't a scam so far. It is a legit thing. I know Kirby Vacuums is a legit thing. I know Door to Door Sales is a legit thing. What I'm saying is this independent uh, distributor that I will be working for, EKG uh, Associates, I got a business card, uh, it's a legit thing. And I'm looking forward to my opportunity with Kirby. Stay tuned, I will make another video tomorrow to let you guys know how the training went. And as always, have a nice day.